On this occasion, we're going to investigate why are some individual, lucky individuals with higher testosterone, how do we make that diagnosis, when is it pathological, and how do we treat it. Testosterone is a steroid-based hormone that's very, very important in two parts of a man's life. During the embryonic stage, testosterone differentiates between girls and boys and actually created the secondary male characteristics such as phallus and also the testicles drop into the scrotum and secondary male characteristics. The second phase of testosterone's importance is during puberty. However, when sometimes that excessive amount of testosterone persisted into adulthood, it might raise some concerns because for some individuals, you might have heightened libido, you definitely get a lot of oily skin and acne, you might get that aggressions and also other things such as excessive hair growth, a lot of shaving, and also other things such as slightly higher blood pressure and slightly thicker blood concentration because of polycythemia. In fact, the testosterone itself is quite variable between individual and even variable between different part of the day. So the best time to make the diagnosis is to take the blood test between 9 a.m. and 11 a.m. because we standardize that level of testosterone. If the testosterone is excessively high, then we're a bit concerned that it might be due to two types of tumour. One of them is called Leydig cell tumour. This is a type of cells inside the testicle may become cancerous and produce excessive amount of testosterone. The other area that may, might be cancerous may be adrenal glands. The adrenal glands uh, sometimes can turn cancerous and produce excess amounts of sex hormone. These two cancers are exceedingly rare. There are some medications that can be used in order to reduce the active form of testosterone. And that itself is the same medicine that is used for enlarged prostate and also hair loss. So for those lucky men out there who's got higher amount of testosterone and perhaps are a bit troubled by this heightened level of male hormone, perhaps the right treatment is on a bit of medication just to cool off that all that male hormone. For the next episode, on this occasion, I'm going to deal with excess amount of testosterone in a woman. So the excess amount of testosterone in a woman, you might think it's something quite harmless, but it can cause quite an embarrassing amount of problem such as hirsutism, growing excessive of facial hair and also coarse voice. So if you are interested to find out why do women have excess amount of testosterone and you are interested to find out a condition called polycystic ovarian syndrome, then stay tuned for next week's Putting Dr. G on the Spot.